Hi everybody, welcome to another edition of James Jam. I'm Jane, this is my jam. I just got a tripod, I'm trying to use everything, sorry if it's a little crooked. Um, and I was all set to go and realized that I, my remote wasn't charged. So I'm gonna try to do this video um, still by myself, but you got to see me turn it on and um, probably be seeing me shut the video off. But um, I just had a haul video for you today. Um, welcome to everybody who's coming back and thank you for everybody who's joining. I'm really pleased to have you here and it's been exciting watching my channel grow little by little and enjoying getting to know everybody a little bit more in the comments. It's a lot of fun. So today, yeah, just have a haul video for you. Just a few things. Um, I'm going to start out with something from Versace. I've been talking about a lot of their stuff lately. I did pick up one thing from the um, the sales. Versace was having a lot of stuff on sale. And so I got an item. It came like this. Um, well, it was inside of another box. And then like this. And I just thought that was really cool. Um, you open it up. And then you get the Versace box like this. And I hope this is not too crooked. If it is, I'm so sorry. Kind of have to view me like this or like this. Um, it'll get better, I promise. Um, but yeah, it came in a box like this. And what I got, I'm just going to open it up here. If anybody needs to see me opening it necessarily. It just comes nicely in a bag like this. Um, the bag's a little flipped over. Here, how about like that? Nicer? And then what I got was something I've been wanting. Um, it... Well, something similar to something I've been wanting. Came with just a little care booklet. But what I got was the little pouches here. Um, this is weird trying to cover my face. Um, so the, um, they, there are three pouches similar to the, um, is it the origami? Is that the right word? Um, pouches from LV. These are really fun though. They have the some of the Versace print on the front. Uh, this one is the, you know, it's got the black cover and then it's got the pink and black design on it. Then you open it up and inside, ta-da, you have the smaller size. And this one, this one's probably my favorite. It's my favorite size and I love the lavender and the black. So you just have the lavender and the black in here. And then you open this. Can you guess what's inside? I think you can. There is another little holder. And this one is yellow. Again, these are just pouches. Um, small little pouches here. Uh, this one would probably fit some cards in it. There, It almost looked like there was a back pocket back here, but there's not. It's just this, and then they got a nice little snap. So I was really pleased to get this. I had looked at the Louis Vuitton ones for a long time, and then when I saw these came up, um, I think I got them for, it was right on $400 for the three. So I thought that was a really good deal. Um, I know the Louis Vuitton ones, when you can find them in store, uh, which has been a little more frequently lately, I believe those are $800. So, um, I just really like these. Um, I thought they were really fun. I do see more Versace in my future. So I just thought that it would be fun to start off, um, with something like this. So I did get this. And then another thing that's not luxury, but I thought I'd show it because I kind of talked about it in my last haul. I actually got um, some pairs of shoes in my last haul, and I got another pair of shoes. And so I thought I'd just share it with everybody um, because I kind of talked about these. I had talked in my last haul about how I really love Converse, but I found that Vans are a lot more comfortable than Converse are. Well, even more comfortable than that are the Karyuma um shoes the here's the box name you can order these they actually ship them in the box they ship them like this um and um so you can get them shipped you know they push again ship them right in the box um then what i got is this was a special order i actually had to order these i want to say maybe in may and they finally just got done making them now these are considered the Pantone shoes. Um, they're, um, let's see, what does it say? Deep Comfort. Um, 
Oh, is there anything? Uh, sun, uh, the collection of sun bleach pastels is an organic ode to change as a source of beauty and revival. Um, and I don't know, it just goes on to, to kind of talk about how the, um, how the soles are, you know, these are made like they're fully stitched, uh, um, outsole, raw, natural rubber sole, um, got certified organic cotton canvas on the shoe and memory foam insole. So what I got was a pair of shoes. These are very similar to Vans and um, Converse, but I just loved the color. It's kind of like a Tiffany blue, but just a little bit more blue, I would say, than the Tiffany blue. Um, yeah, it just says um, then Pantone on the side here and on the tongue. But these shoes are so comfortable. The soles are just white like that. And um, they are pricier. These run like 70, between 75 and $90 versus Converse. You're, you could probably, if you go to Kohl's, you could probably get Converse as low as $15 if you get a really good sale. Otherwise, in general, I want to say they're between probably 30 and 50, or if you have an outlet by you, they're cheaper. I say Vans run about the same um, as that, depending on the deal you get. Um, I don't know that I've ever seen Vans at $15, but um, but still, you can get them really reasonably, especially on sale or if you live by a Vans outlet. Um, I'm not aware of where they sell these um, necessarily in the US, but um, they, I don't, I'm not sure. I just ordered mine online from the company. It was just um, www.kariuma, uh, that's C-A-R-I-U-M-A dot com. And yeah, these, these are so comfortable. I can wear these all day long and they don't hurt my feet at all. I feel really, really comfortable in them. So I just wanted to show everybody because my last haul had a pair of Vans and some Crocs. So if I'm gonna be talking about comfortable shoes, might as well throw the most comfortable in there. Um, the next thing I got was, um, I'm looking around here because I have my stuff kind of all over the place. Um, let's see, I'm just trying to see where the items are found it. <laughs> the next thing I got here was another item from the House of Silage. Silage, 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 Silage. Um, I have been unable to resist these. I don't even know if it's so much the fragrance or the um, containers, but I got another one. Um, let's see, this is the um, holiday. Um, version and you just open it up to find your little cupcake inside they actually even come with their own dust cloths but you have the top here and it's just filled at my fan I'm sorry with um Zorowski crystals and yeah it's just a beautiful beautiful little um candle this one's got the crystals are all um colored not sure if you can see them good or not but I just got that the scent is very uh this is probably the most fresh scent um there always seems to be like a hint of powder in them but um they're this one's definitely like more fresh than some of my other ones I'll put the notes and everything um in the description box below if you're interested but again it's it just says holiday up at the top right there sorry about my fan in the <laughs> It's gonna look neat in the picture, but um, yeah, just um, I really like these. Again, I they're beautiful to look at. the The scents are great. They last a long time. Um, I yeah, I I really really like them. The only thing I could say is I was definitely get them on sale. I think I paid a hundred dollars for that, um, including free shipping, and then you get a couple trial sizes too in there. So definitely. Um, definitely look for sales. I don't know that I pay full price, but I enjoy them. And especially when you get them on sale and they are always running sales. Like they have a different sale every day, sometimes twice a day. So, um, there's that. Then as I go off camera again, my last item is from LV. I was super excited to get this. Um, I had been wanting one of these items for a long time. 
Um, this one came up and I grabbed it right away. I was really excited. It was kind of hard to choose. There's three colors that have come out this season. It's from the men's line um, that I am absolutely in love with. There's a green, an orange, and a purple or a lavender. Um, I still am thinking about getting the um, pocket or organizer in the ombre leather. Um, I want to get um, one of the three colors at least. Um, still debating, do I really need it? Probably not. Do I love the color so then I want it? Yeah. But the one that I had to have, and I, this one has some um, canvas on it as well, but um, I thought this went the best with the canvas. Um, came in a little box, and it came with um, the bow. It was all decorated really nice. I know for a while they weren't giving out things. Um, they weren't giving out ribbons. I be I think I've even seen some where they didn't have boxes, but it came nicely packaged in a really nice box. I've already opened it because I wanted to check it, wanted to look at it, and watching me fumble through opening something isn't always the greatest. So I just thought I'd open it ahead of time. So what I got was this. Is this a pocket organizer too, or a little wallet? Um, it's I love the green. So I still would like something with the lavender or the orange or both, but um, I just love this green and brown together. Um, the, it has one, two, three, three card slots here, but you honestly could stick another couple cards in, in this section here. The back always um, opens up as well. And this is a lot longer one, so if you had something a little bit longer you wanted to stick in, you could. There's also then a nice zipper up here and that opens up to like a coin spot um let's see mine is made in paris um here's the here's the tag if you want to see that but um yeah it was really interesting i wasn't sure what to expect and it's actual the leather up here is smooth and soft i'll try to put it up there so you can see it because i was not expecting that um, I was expecting it to be more like the interior, um, like a coated canvas. Um, so I just, I was pleasantly surprised to see the soft leather on there. So yeah, um, I just thought this is awesome. I love the green. I was really excited to get this piece. Um, they, I've been watching them. They've had, uh, the colors kind of go off and on the site as to whether or not they're available. Um, I think when I got this one, um, only two of the three colors were available, the orange and the green. And, um, again, like I said, I, I just really, really like the green with the brown. So it was, it was no brainer. That's the one that I wanted, but, um, yeah, I was just really excited to get that. So that's the, what I have today for a haul. I, um, I hope love easy for me to say. I upload videos on um, Wednesdays and Saturdays and um, some spurt, interdispersed in between when I get a chance. Um, I have um, the next video coming up will be uh, Wednesday and I believe that's going to be a tag video. I'm going to do one of the tags of basically like all, all my bags of a certain color and um, Winnie V. Winnie B. L. V. um, kind of tagged everybody, so I'm gonna just take the bag and take it. The... You know, you'd think this was Monday, <laughs> and it's not. It's filming it on Friday afternoon or Friday evening. Words are hard. And, um, yeah, Winnie B. L. V. did the tag, and thankfully, she tags a whole bunch of people at the end of her videos, so I'm just gonna take the tag and go take care of it. There's another tag I also want to film. Um, the, if money were no object, which five luxury items would I want? Um, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do it as of uh, things from luxury houses. Cause obviously like, I think there are certain cars that would be very luxurious, um, that I would like, like Maybe not the typical because if I if money was no object and I could have any car I wanted, I would buy a um, a Dodge Demon 
it's a challenger that's in the demon it's a dodge demon but it's basically the challenger uh, body chassis and um they come with one seat and they are super rare they only make a few hundred of them like or more like 200 or less a year um that would be my idea of the epitome of the one thing if i if money was no object i would grab um but i'm just going to talk in the luxury realm so um that's always a lot of fun uh, there's a lot of fun stuff out there that I don't know that even if I had the money for it, I would spend it. Um, but if we're going to say absolutely um, money is no object whatsoever, then I'm going to have some fun. So I have a couple items picked out and just going to pick out a few more. That one I'll probably do in the next um, upcoming weeks. Uh, probably have another um, unboxing coming up soon too. So yeah, just um, a lot of fun stuff to show. Um, I was going to show, I did get um, a Coach Cassie in the Nordstrom style. I got the reddish orange one. I was going to bring that up here and then I, I thought no because I know a lot of people have now shown them. Um, but mine was mine was perfect. Um, I feel bad. I know that Dawn Loves Couture had gotten one and um, it, it was not what she was expecting or hoping for. Uh, mine was beautiful, pristine, wonderful condition. It was only $199, I know, not only, but compared to the $350 price, I liked the $199. I was really excited because I didn't think there'd ever be any more Cassies. So um, if you want me to show that, let me know. I'd be glad to show that in my next video. Uh, otherwise, just thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you want to come back, I'd really like that. Please subscribe, consider it. Um, like the video, uh, leave comments. I love it. Like I said, it's, it's really nice kind of getting to know everybody a little bit more in the comments, um, getting to know everybody's sense of humor a little bit more, what they like, um, just a lot of fun and opens up a lot of new ideas about things or we find things that we both like. Um, I just, I really like sewing. Um, I don't normally talk about that here, but I found a few other people that find some of the same creators on YouTube that do things having to do with uh, sewing or um, uh, certain clothing and stuff um, interesting. So yeah, it's just a lot of fun. Um, but uh, that'll do this. <laughs> that'll do it for today. Boy, I am really sorry. Again, I'm all excited because I'm filming this by myself and um, yeah. I'll get better, I promise. And um, until next time, please do unto others as you would have them do unto you. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.